last time on Dog Naropa, Trigger Happy Havoc. (coughs) Sakura! The best I could. When I laid my hands on her. All I felt was cold death. And now, back to trying to ditch school. If you just do it, it'll turn out okay. Even if your muscle is dead. Hey everyone, it's been Dave 98 here, and we're back to more Dark Naropa, Trigger Happy Havoc. Last time, we did a little bonding with uh, Tagami and Toko. And we, and we made up and we made up with Kirigiri after we got Alter Ego plugged up into the network. But then we found Sakura's cold, dead body. How'd she die? Let's find out. Unfortunately, it's another friend of ours is dead. Who's the murderer? Do you know? You only feel the last sleeping warmth of a living body. Life had abandoned Sakura's body. And then... A body has been discovered! No! After a certain amount of time, which you may use however you like, the class trial will begin! Huh? Sakura's. Sakura's. Is that music coming? Dead? She's really dead. I heard Hina talking. But my eyes stared steadily forward. I could only look on at Sakura's dead body. We didn't make it in time. Doggy. You sh- you sh- Mikado, you should have broke the window faster. It's happened again. Muttering to herself, Kyoko began to gently inspect Sakura's body. I wonder if she was confirming that Sakura really was dead, checking for a pulse or a reaction. Me? I, ha- I think I'll get him! I think I'll get the others! Shaky so legs, Hina left the room, rec room. And I. Why? Why does this have to happen? That's all I could say. Repeat all over again. Why does that have to happen? 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 Hi. I need to say in Sakura's body. I just stood there motionless while behind her while she checked Sakura's corpse. Time passed. Why I stood there unable to do a thing, time just passed. And after I didn't know know how long, I got every I got everyone. What? Okay, okay, mom. Mm, yes, yes. Ah, so he's dead, huh? I see. Sakura's been killed. I see. As soon as they began arrived, Kyoko began. Just a second. 
You heard, you heard the announcement just now, right? Right? So you know what this means. Hmm. Interesting. <clears throat> Sucker was murdered by someone in this very room. Is that what you're going to say? Huh? No. Whoever killed her? Oh, there's someone in this room. It's your fault. It's one of you. Hero, Byakya, Telka, one of you killed Sakura. What? You're accusing us before you even begin the investigation? I don't even think of anything. Did you hate her? You, did you hate the sight of her? Forgive you. What if you did? I know you did. You know it? Ba -bum, ba -bum. Jeez! I didn't know your power level was crisp by that much like you getting mad! What the heck? What are you doing? What are you doing here? Come on! Isn't it obvious? I hit it out my little mother fire! It's the Monokuma file! Yeah! <laughs> don't get so mad, Miss Cena! Are you gonna ruin that you're gonna ruin that little face of yours? Hmm. How then with that eye? Hold on. Something I want to ask you. It was you, wasn't it? You killed Sakura. Say what? <laughs> Sakura wanted to challenge the mushroom mind to a duel. Maybe you and her, her fought again and then... Did I kill her? Hmm? Sorry, not quite. Actually, not even close. The whole thing is totally irrelevant now! Sakura, Sakura came to the most regrettable end without even getting a chance to finish things with me! Monokuma! Phew! But thank God for that! Woohoohoo! It saved me the trouble for him to go through that little fight! Team for someone like me, there would have been no mean feat to take out down on humans like that! Hey, um... I gotta tell you, I was pretty, actually pretty worried! I mean, she violated a rule by attacking me in the first place, but I wasn't able, wasn't able to punish her. Well, so I don't know who it was, but whoever the blocking is this time, I owe you one! What is this? Yo, one! <laughs> Oopsie! But before you get all pissy potty at me, you better figure out who did it first! Shing! That means all your lights are on the line, right? Poo hoo hoo! Poo hoo hoo! <laughs> He yells someone! I won't forgive you. I hate him! I hate the whole thing! <laughs> well, I, for one, am glad it was Sakura. She was working for the mastermind after all. How can you say that now? <laughs> Sorry, I don't have time for your little squabbling. The next game has already begun. Who be angry at someone? Be angry at whoever killed Sakura. Yep. Anyway. Right now, right now, our top priority needs to be uncovering Sakura's killer. If we can't even do that, we're dead. Hmm. Then let's decide, let's decide who was the guard this time. I'll do it! Hina? Okay! Just let me handle it. So I'm gonna be here with Sakura. Okay then, but he has guard number one. But we need one more. Kyoko, that's you. What? Me? Me? Hmm. You're always a thorn in my side. It's time to stand by and watch quietly. Consider that an order. An order? That's fine. Fine. I'll stay behind. Hmm. Then it's settled. Let's begin, shall we? Hold on! For that, something I want to say. What? Which is, peasant girl? Harold, Byakuya, Toko, none of you ever saw the stuff from this crime scene. Huh? What, Mom? It's your fault! What if you killed Sakura? I won't forgive you. I don't want to see someone like that come anywhere near her. Stop talking. 
Don't be stupid. Unless when the but what's the danger is yours. You have every right to investigate. I don't care what you say. Not only the one who killed Sakura anywhere near her. You know, I meant to be tightly forced. You're not getting in here. What appears for the discussion will be a waste of time. How about a compromise? It's all clear. I won't ask to let all of you, all of us in, just let me. Hmm. You don't really care, you don't really care, do you? You're both useless anyway. Yep. Nope, don't really care. Nope, don't really care. I left, I left in my time. Coming up for another spend of fancy. It's probably master anyway. Hmm. New hero? Do you really object? Uh, um... You're gonna go that far. You're gonna go that far, Mon. I, 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 what do I? What can I do? I mean, I don't have anything to hide. So why should I care, Mon? It's all clear now. And it's decided. What are you saying? Nothing decided. Calm down. I know how you feel, Hina. You should agree to his request. But hey, we have to find out who killed Sakura. Correct. For those who are us are still alive and to honor Sakura's memory. Mm. Fine, I guess that's okay. But no matter what, Byakia, you're absolutely not allowed to touch her. <laughs> Natu naturally. Who would want to touch a filthy dead body? Listen. That's enough fighting. We need to focus on the investigation from here on out. Everyone keep this in mind. If we can't cover Sakura's killer, Listen to me. all of us face execution. Why not to kill Sakura? I'm out of hoping we can do it. We survive. We have to do it. It's kind of hopeless hope. No choice, but just to do it. Just do it. Check my kill file before anything else. The victim was Sakura Ogami. The time of death is what's made to be around 12 noon. Why was discovered on the deck room on the third floor of the, of the school? That was a strong blow to the victim's head, and their injuries were noted. However, it seemed that at some point the victim suffered from the violent vomiting of blood. Handbook. Hey. Hmm. I think this case. I think the case this time might be a challenge. Challenge? Why is that? So... Hmm. The only way into the rec room is the door we just came through. And that door has been jammed shut from the chair from the inside the rec room. To be the killer would have to, have, have to escape somehow after barring the door. So the door is blocked from the inside and there's no way in or out until we broke the window? Like zero chance, like zero escape, right? In other words, in other words, this is a classic locked room murder. Locked room murder. I guess you, I guess you might see this kind of thing in a lot of mystery novels or books or whatever. But can, but, but can it really happen in real life? Real life? Because this is real life, mom. And right before our eyes, like this. Hey. Are you curious to hear more about what a locked room murder entails? Sure! I got a few spare minutes. That's fine. When you break... When you break down the kind of murder mystery, there's are four basic types. The first type is when the locked room is created after the actual crime is committed. This simply means that the killer commits his crime, then through some special method, seals the room. This mainly involves some type of trick involving the locking of the room. Basic approaches include using a string or a simple mechanism. There are a number of variations. So, so for the, so for that, all we do is check the door to see if that was right. Correct. The second type is when the locked room already exists before the crime is committed. Oh? In other words. 
Basically, basically the killer uses a special contraption or a tool from outside to target the victim inside. You push a switch and it fires a handgun. You shoot an arrow through a gap in the door or something like that. However, in this case, it doesn't seem to fit. There are no guns or arrows in the school, and the door doesn't have any gaps that would allow, allow it. Yeah, I think we probably crossed that one off the list. It's true. Third type is when the killer stays in the room until it is opened up. What do you mean by that? In other words. They stay hidden, and when the door is opened, they use the confusion to blend in with the group. They pretend that the, they pretend to show the up they show up all along with everyone else, and that's that. That sounds like that could be impossible, maybe. It's true. And the fourth and final type is when it wasn't a actually a locked room at all. Not a locked room? In other words. By that, I mean there's actually an alternate escape route somewhere in this, within this room. You see that a lot of novels and, th and things, but in reality, it's generally, it's generally not possible. You, you think you can cross that off the list too? Indeed. Well, I believe so, yes. So when it comes to locked room mysteries, those are the basics. Kiri Giri 101. So there are four possibilities. Then Kiyoki, okay, what's the those four choices you can most likely in this case? It's true. Hmm, that's a good question. Answering that to be our primary focus during this trial. But right now, I really can't say. I can't really say. I see. The way the killer set up this locked room. So I figured that out. The truth behind Sakura's death will stay hidden. So in the least mystery, I need to concentrate and investigate as much as I can. For Sakura, nothing else. It's like some kind of rapper. Huh? Huh, that! Do you recognize it, Hina? Well... Well, well, yeah, I mean, I gave it to her. It's a candy wrapper. Sakura got up super upset when she found out Genocide had jewel it. Uh, attacked me, right? After we left the nurse's office, I gave it to her. Gave it to her. I thought I thought it might help her calm down a little. So you got that candy to Sakura? I found the big box of in the warehouse. I, re I really, really, I really, really like them. Actually, as soon as we got in the, in the warehouse, I took the entire box back to my room. I'm sure no one else could get their hands on them. Do you like them that much? But I want Sakura to give her a chance to get to her room for herself. That's why I gave it to her. But now they all lost their flavor. Yeah. Can you wrapper my dear truth bolts? Hmm. Try the glass get out when the chair is Sakura sitting on. Glass is all red and the tops and bottom sections of a bottle, right? This must, really, this must have really been a bottle! It's a true bullshit handbook. Oh, there's something else on the ground near the glass. It's a figure! It puts it upon my hand. It's a Monokuma figure! I'm add the truth bullets. There are four red bottles lined up on the shelf. I bottle this around my Kuba figure. I'm wondering is how they get the figures inside the bottles. So hmm. it's no different than your standard ship in a bottle. Huh? You know where bottle the bottle opening is smaller than the boat plate boat placed inside? You never seen that? Oh yeah, maybe I have. In other words. So this is the Monokuma version of that. A Monokuma bottle, if you will. I'm trying to sit and things a little by little. I'll see on the shelf. The figure on the ground. So glass, it probably started out as a bottle. I mean, Sakura must have been hit with a Monokuma bottle, right? Sounds like glass, a Monokuma figure, all of that. 
So I said, so I think, so I said, so I think it's safe to say the bomb came battle with the weapon. The locker's open. And there on the inside, it's a handprint? Why? Hmm, what's a handprint doing here? Looks like someone touched the inside of the locker. And also a handprint on, and all the dust. It's true. Huh. Well, and it looks quite fresh, too. I'd say someone was hiding inside, in, here in the locker and left something behind something a little extra. So then, maybe the killer hidden here until the locker room was opened? Don't you think? And then all the creases and they popped out and joined the rest of the group. Wrong. Hmm, unfortunately, that's not a possibility. Huh? Well, why not? Hey. Think back before you. Yeah, oh, I'm sorry. Think back before you open the door. There, look inside the room, right? Oh, oh yeah, look right for that point. Indeed. So there's no some no way someone can hit in there until after we open the door. Yeah. So then, what's this handprint mean? A handprint has anti truth bullets. The what stay in front of the magazine shelf? Well, they come from Sakura, right? Doesn't make any sense. Why is it so far away from she died? Sakura drew her last breath, sitting slumped forward in this chair. Uh, it was obvious blow, it was a blow of the head that Sakura suffered. I don't think I have any problem believing that's what killed her. According to my the file, she also she had also vomited blood. She traces on her, a blood on her lips for sure. So what caused her to vomit blood? Can't let the file simply specifically said she had suffered any other injuries. Maybe seeing the head somehow this kind of caused her to start vomiting blood. Not a chance. Yakia. That's fine. However, your eyes have la 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 landed on the most interesting location. Interesting? Naturally. Yes, most interesting. Don't you agree? No, I don't think I call it interesting. This makes me wonder. The reason Sakura vomited blood absolutely has to be the way she died. That same self full of magazines. I'll get magazines here. Right now, file died at 112 noon. Left me an hour ago. Is that when that took killed my eyes with my alter ego? What the heck? We already know who did it. I won't forgive you. Yaki here. I'll be one of them. I said inside of her. You really don't, Jimikado? I won't say anything for sure about finding out more. Meep! Let me help you find out more. You see, Sakura asked all three of them. Meet with them here, her, you know, where? Right here in this rec room. What? I, I tried to the nurse's office this morning, Sakura and I both looked together, right? I was just leaving we off on our own. I saw that again, she told me there's a note for each of them. I have to meet them here in the rec room by noon. By noon, my confile says she died right around then. I tell you the truth, I heard it right from Sakura herself. I tried to stop her. She wouldn't listen. She said not to worry that she just wouldn't talk to him. This is what happened! And I stopped her by force even this, this never would have happened! Yeah. Possible not to have regrets, I know. She said I just to meet her here. She asked him to come with the record at noon. Same time she placed the injury of dying. Let me get that data from read it directly. However Her Sakura but for Sakura had been killed. Yeah, she doesn't have to go down for a fight. It's true. She sure, and she certainly didn't, I would say. She was the ultimate martial artist, strong in body, mind, and spirit. So how was the killer able to get the upper hand on her? 
I wonder, does someone did you give her a hand? It's gonna take her by surprise, right? Certainly. They would they would have needed to. They expected to stand any chance against her. Kind of public container rolling around in the entrance of the room. So it's like a protein drink. It's empty. It's like I was to drink it. Everyone knows how much she loves her protein. And more than what she wants, how protein was good for all sorts of elements. Wrong. I wouldn't take up the heart if I were you. I know. So this protein drink can. It's got a label on it that says Kim A2. That reminds me, Sakura mentioned out that Kim Lab had all kinds of healthy stuff. Health stuff. Healthy stuff. Health, healthy health stuff. So, 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 so you must have gotten this from the Kim Lab. Just a second. But that's strange. Huh, what is? Hey. You see what's got around the, the can? Shards of blue glass. That was a. I broke. I. I. Yeah, I got. I, 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 I broke the inside. Correct. But they aren't just scattered underneath around the can. It's also scattered underneath it. Why does that matter? So... I can't say for sure, but you're probably gonna need to take a note of it. I feel like it'll become an important clue later on. Important clue? I'm not sure how! But if you say so, Kirigiri, Kyoko, I'll do it. Tara said to get the doorknob so we can get the door open. There's no evidence of any kind of string or mechanism used on the chair. Well, so there's no reason that Tara is not done to it. Hey. Please. Certainly. What? What do you want? You're bothering me. I don't know what I was talking to you about. Hmm. Make it quick, peasant boy. Is it true that Sakura asked you to meet her in the rec room? <laughs> so, so you found out. It's interesting. That's true. I did receive a note to that effect. Yes. What well, fool will do then? What is it in risk of being killed by that monster? So you didn't go see her? Of course I'm not. Of course not. I heard that note to shred and threw it away. I haven't seen Sakura today at all. The Akiya says he didn't go see her. Is that the truth? Until I can prove otherwise, I had no choice except to this fact. Come on. If you're all finished, if you're all finished, please remove yourself from my sight. Okay, thanks. Wait in another rec room. The door have a lock and there's no event that the not lines have been tampered with. A notable change to the door is to smash the window. Have of course when we broke in to get inside. I don't think any kind of string or mechanism using the door. In other words, I don't see anything that says about this door at all it's, oh, itself. And both the door and the chair. That the, there's no doubt the door, reason the door didn't open simply because the chair was shoved against it. It's kept the doorknob from turning and the door from opening. The evidence that a door or chair being tampered with or anything like that. So it must have created a locker room door from the inside, not from the outside. Doors add to the truth bullets. Listen. Well, Makoto, have you finished your general investigation? Yeah, I think so for the most part. So then. You should probably still talk to people now. I'm on guard duty, so I can't leave. Listen to me. This is why I decided to you go in my place. She's decided? It's got a little bit more pussy since we had our issue. But she's, but she's right. I had to go talk to the others. That girl had one of two other people. I need to hear what they had to say.
Yeah. The, the third two play went back to their rooms. Doorbell. A few seconds. Mm. Who's there? Ah, ah, the most negative aura I, I ever felt. An aura of total decay. Well, what do you want? So you're back to normal. Genocide Jack isn't around anymore. Don't even say her name. It makes me sick to my stomach. I was in such a good mood, too. She looked like, she looked like she was in a good mood. Hey, I was hoping to talk to you about something. Is now a bad time? Maybe. I was annoyed. Toko slid her out in the hall. What do you want? Do you want to talk to me about, to me about something? I want to talk to you about the fact that Sakura asked you to meet with her. What? Well. I don't know what you're talking about. Yaki already told me that she asked me to meet with him. <laughs> what, what? What? She wanted to meet with Master too? <laughs> I just said two, didn't I? <laughs> I guess still feel obvious now, huh? Yeah, pretty much. Can you tell me about it? I admit it, I didn't take the note. But I didn't go see her. I was scared, so I couldn't bring myself to go. I mean, Toko just didn't go see her, but can I really believe her? Until I could otherwise, I had no choice except that's fact. Mm -hmm. That's good enough. I'm not back in my room. That Toko retreated in your room. It's triple. Press the doorbell. A few seconds. You know. What's that, Kamakura? Did you need something, Mon? Yeah, I actually, want to check on something. But how Sakura wanted to meet with you. What? What? How do you know about that? Could it be? You can't even get in your soul. Have your special abilities waking you. Um. I'm the one to meet with Mon. I'll be telling yourself that she asked Byaki and Toka to come too. Why wouldn't Sakura tell you that? Uh, well... Uh, um... I have to meet me with her, of course. But then she write you a note. Uh, yeah, a note she, uh... How about that? Get the first person to have to meet the others. Like in passing! I'll be honest, this is super suspicious. So then you went with Sakura? Got it all wrong. No, 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 I don't ever do that. Yeah, definitely suspicious. Actually... I thought I saw the girls when he got hurt and I took the nurse office. Mon? Just don't look at me. I haven't seen her since then. I'm here. Can you show me the notes she, she gave you? Um. Uh, do I still have it? Uh, let's see. Let's block it. Hey, come on. Well, I'll try. I don't have any more. I guess on his face, he pulled out the hand back in his pocket. When he did, I saw something float to the ground. I don't know how far here was pocket. Huh? Huh? Ah! What? To get us the win, Hero starts it up back up again. Back in his pocket. Hey, come on! Yeah, sorry, the trash I found to throw out. Trash. What? what? Uh, yeah, anyways, I can't deny Ogre asked me to meet with her, but I never went. So, excuse me! Leave me, Mon! And for reply, Hero quickly slipped back up on his room. So, it's, it's trash, but. No way there's. The, the, there's no way that's all there was to it. Pocket trash. Sir Tokotero, what next? I didn't have to extra crime scene again. But on top of that, I guess I have more of the protein can I found in the flush for the rec room. Crimson the chem lab. Where do I start?
Makoto, do you have your eyes in the Kim lab too? Just make sure you don't get in my way. Yeah, I got it. Jerk. I think I think what you meant to say was yes, sure, I understand. No, I meant jerk. Look at the shelf. You know how big it is. Let's take a closer look at it. The three shelves have been connected together to make one giant shelf. More important right now, it's that powder that's been spilled in front of the shelf. I kept all that stuff in it. It's a broken bottle in front of the shelf. Is that where the powder came from? I look like the, bo the bottle had the label on it. Chem C4. Hmm. Would you like to hear something interesting? Is it from you? Then no, no thank you. I was on the f I was on the fourth floor this morning checking things out. At that point, this room wasn't like this. The powder must be so spilled. In other words. That's right. It could only been spilled around the time of the incident. That's really how it happened. And then surely the case somehow. Just part of an actual truth bullets. These are footprints. They're, fr they're from the sh life shelf. Hmm. Huh, how do these footprints relate to the scene as a whole? We may need to stretch out the floor plan. By we, do you mean me? Kind of you to offer. Fun serverable smirk. He handed me a piece of paper and a pen. What? Well, let's go. Chop, chop. Ugh. Why stab me this pen? Uh, but okay. So I got to work, and before long, I drew up a sketch of the room. Uh, how's this? Not bad for you, I mean. For me. I see. Something like this, interesting. It would appear that whoever had left these footprints only had business at the leftmost shelf. The hangman did straight, straight to that shelf, did what they, what they can't have to do, and then left. The footprints tell me. Hmm. But these these footprints these footprints must be it's certainly possible. Makoto, are they yours? No. What? Okay, the, okay, okay. Then let me see your shoes and from the side for myself. Take off your shoes. Take off your shoes, peasant boy. Take them off. I, mean, I can think of the reason not to. I, like when I smack him for calling me peasant, peasant keep calling. You called me peasant boy! But I quietly did but, uh, read what Byakuya said. Hmm. I see. Your feet appear to be too big. These, these, these feet are too big. Unfortunately, I must admit these are not your footprints. Unfortunately. Hmm. Well, of course. Well, if clear these prints are, it's been quite easy to determine who they do belong to. Can there be a really valuable clue? Footprints. It's like this. The pattern. Left and that's it. So it happened to the left. But anyways. It's clear so we have to figure out who they are. It's a valuable clue. Yellow powder scattered on the floor. At least for print on it. I heard that powder. It's a yellow powder floor shelf. Broken bottle. Bottle was played with Kim 4. This also looks like someone left footprints in the powder. What's in the footprints are just the shelf. Blah blah blah. I put it for it. In time of the incident. I can do for now.
So on the shelf is like a bunch of chemicals that I'll get what they are. The reagents. Please, what they put? The reagents. Simply put, they're used in they're used in experiments to bring out a chemical reaction. How have you lived in ignorance for so long? It would truly be bliss. Isn't that kind of harsh? What? What? You think it's saying science and mathematics has no practical place in the, in the real world? Fine. The words of a lifelong loser, as I suppose, suit you well. Are you gonna say that? And it's my it's held on the shelf. All the containers on the shelf are labeled letter B and a number. So I guess I, guess I can share this part of the shelf in section B. Hmm, see the ordinary here. Let's move about this shelf. This shelf is. I uh, when looking at it, I can tell it's nothing but dangerous chemicals. This is like poisons and other powerful chemicals. All the containers on this shelf are labeled with the letter C and a number. I guess I can see this as part of the shelving section, unit section C. Let's see what's on this, what's on this shelf. Okay, dietary chemicals, dietary supplies, and different medicines. The protein drink we came, we found in the record, probably came from this shelf. All the containers on this shelf are labeled with letter A and a number. It's Sesame Street. We're brought to you by the letter A and the number number nine. But wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. I see a C nine here. So I guess I can consider this part of the selfie section A, huh? I saw it first, Noggy. One ball in here is labeled Kim 9. Could someone have put it there on accident? All right, for my other shelving unit. Let's see sections. A dies with some insects, B has three jazz, and sector C has lethal chemicals. Sucker must have got the protein powder from section A. But what concerns me from then section A, there is a bottle of the label from section C. What's the bottle of poison doing from section C doing in section A? Definitely something going on around here. Can wipes up and add to the truth bullets. I think I'll, I've taken a good look around there. Is that camera wrap? Maybe I'll take another lap around the rec room. Hey. So Makoto, how how's your investigation going? I told I told Kyoko what Toko and and Hiro had told me. I see. So I see. So along with Yakia, they're both claiming they didn't go see her. It's all too convenient. Someone must be lying. Someone, someone's lying. Anyway, anyway, I must pockets my own. Sucker's body, the in the magazines, and the, uh, the mark in the bottles. These three things are filled with new clues. You would do well to look over them one more time. I've seen someone's hand clue of some kind. Hmm, clue, clue. I might see it upside down. I'm gonna put it back to there on an accident? Hey. Hmm. If something catches your eye, it's important for you to explore the deta that detail, don't you think? Yeah, you're right. I pick up the inverted magazine and flip through it. Did I cut, did I cut myself? 
No, it feels like I did though. Feels like I scratched myself. Ugh. I, that, that's not important right now. Pick up the Avery magazine and flip through it. This is. On the, on, the, on the pages that near the center of the magazine, the words the word has been written in blood, bold, blade letters. And it said, Toko, Toko, Tokyo? Could it be? A dying message? Correct. It would appear you found it. Kyoko, is this? So. It is indeed a dying message. Someone used their finger to write it. A dying message? However. But just to be clear, I don't want to put it back upside down. I sure I liked it when I found that a little while ago. I made, I made sure to put it back, back exactly as I found it. For the benefit of the others who might come along looking. Um... Hey, is that? That's his token, right? Yeah, it looks like it. What the heck? This is the killer, right? Well, I haven't been confirmed yet. I will forgive you. Still, so, so, the killer for sure. That's no evidence, right? With you to the killer. See how you think that, but it's just too easy. I think it seems like that. Like it seems like that's a little bit more suspicious. My magazine is at the truth thoughts. Uh, on the inside, handprint. Why? That's pretty here. It's true. Hey. Oh. Oh, we got that one. Indeed. Bottles. I think I'll get faster than the one of my bottles. Something new or so something new, something new. Hmm. Hey. So, so did you figure it out? There's a hidden correlation between all the bottles. Pay careful attention and you're sure to find it. Correlation. Um. I can't believe you told me what it was. Can you tell me what it is? So. I don't mind guiding you towards the clues, but giving you my conclusion isn't a good idea. Each person needs to have their own conclusion so that everyone can have confidence in the outcome. And that's because you don't trust me, right? No answer. I did trust you, to a degree. Otherwise, I wouldn't have told you anything to begin with. Only to a degree? Oh, no, that's your sex book. Hey. Actually, it's, actually, it's one of the things with the Makami bottles that have been bothering me. I'll like to experiment to confirm it. You don't mind helping me, right? Experiment? It's science time with Kirigiri! Anyway. You gotta have the bottle, piece of the broken, broken bottle. Try to get all the smaller pieces too. Hi, right, sure it's okay to mess with the crime scene like that? Doesn't matter. I've already done a thorough investigation, so it's, 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 it's fine. And that, I, I, not, 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 that Noxus Tagami is, is, is not here, so. So then. Anyway, anyway I need to get something from the Kim lab while I'm gone trying to get all the glass. With that, Kyoko left the room. I don't know what this is about, but what choice do I have? I better, I better go do it. I'm, I'm, the, I'm the submissive type. So I took the I took the broom and the dustpan and got to work. I found the broken ball pieces. As I finished up, sorry to keep you waiting. So then, uh, everything ready? Then let's get to work. So, what kind of experiment are we doing? In other words. I got a skill from the Kim lab. We're gonna use it to, to compare weight. Or the weights of, of what? The piece of gla the, the, piece of, the piece of glass you collected in one of the Mokami bottles that's still intact. Why do you wanna do that? That's the point of the experiment. Well, Makes sense we're done. Listen. First of first all, let's cover the weight of the two normal of two normal Mokami bottles. 
It's balanced. In other words. Which means which means each monkey by the way is about the same. Which which makes sense. I can put figures inside the, basically the same. Nothing else can really affect the weight. So then. Now, here comes the important part. Put a little piece of, up the, uh, on one side of the scale. Now, what, do you, my, what might we expect to see? Well, normal obsession would be either they balance out, the pieces I collected will be lighter. I did my best to get them all. There's a chance I might I could have missed something here and so there. Okay, then let's give it a try. Huh? Record pieces are heavier? How's that possible? I knew it. Just as I thought. What? In other words. The results of the experiment and the comparison between each of the bottles put all together. Okay. And I believe that you'll arrive at a very persuasive conclusion. I'm smiling. I'm smiling at you because I know you'll get it, Nagi, Makoto, Makoto. So what do you think? It's all on you. Can okay, I spell very bad to the truth balls your handbook? Can I put the in the room? room. Okay, okay, it's empty. Yeah, everyone else wants to go for protein. Let's sell this protein can. Can you got anyone? It says can. A2. This must go into the chem lab. Hey. We see this guy around the can? Charge of blue, charge of blue glass. They must be part of the window I broke the inside. Yeah. What's underneath it? Why does that matter? So... I can get out of it. Later on. In other words. And then there's a race to put together. Hey. On you. Um, apparently, the floor is heavier than the top blue bottle. <coughs> well, it's not something common. Apparently, I found a secret, secret, secret hidden here. I won't forgive you. It's like it's a killer, I'm sure of it! He improves it! We got the killer cornered! There's just been a killer in Sakura's body. Just a second. Just stay on space and it'll help you figure anything out. Yeah, I know, but. Hey. Don't you think you might need to actually examine the body? Eh? Ew. There's no key around it. Unlike me, Kyoko didn't recall the touch, touch and dead body. She was, was completely, um, she was completely, she was completely unemotional. The kind of thing I've, I've grown perversely used to. Well, so sometimes I can't believe how calm you are. No matter how many times I see a dead body, I can't get used to it. It's true. That's totally normal. And how can you? So I imagine it's because I played opportunities to touch dead bodies in the past. What? Sorry, never mind. Hey. More importantly, look here. Her shoes. Correct. You see, that ye you see that yellow powder on her instep? Yeah, it really stands out. I see. That powder is clue number one. Hey. Next to the window ahead. Look carefully. It's true. Actually, even telling you that telling you that it's incredibly difficult to spot. So let's let me explain. It would seem. It would appear she didn't suffer a single blow, but instead received two blows to the head. Two blows, one blow, two blows, ha ha ha. Indeed. Interesting, wouldn't you, wouldn't you say? And there's one more interesting thing. Correct. Both their hands were spotless. There's absolutely no trace of blood on either one. It's true. So that's what I learned from examining her body in detail. Kilka experiment summary has added to the truth bullets. I can't believe she's all the touching looking at her body. I don't know if I don't know if, I don't think if anyone in Bakyoko could have pulled that off. Uh oh. Time's up. Hmm? Meep. 
Meep. Whoops, you caught me sleeping. Your investigation was just so boring, I couldn't stay awake. Should I do it? Is it okay? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Okay, then let's begin the class trial. You know where to meet, right? We done this before. Done this three times already. You, 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 should get, you should get know what to do by now. Get the, get the, get the, get, get stepping. Please go through the red door on the first floor of the school. I told you anyways. <laughs> See you soon. It's already time. It's already time. But the mystery's locker room's only, it's only half solved. At this point, whatever happens will have to happen at the class trial. No, not whatever happens. I have to make something happen. Time for the third door. Time for the trial. Of trial of life. Trial of death. Next time on Dagnar Trigger Happy Havoc. <sighs> thanks for thanks for thanks for watching this video with me. And if you want to make this vi make videos better, how about a little, a little something something with the how about a little something something with my Patreon. How about checking out my Amazon wish list? I have one, you know. To make these things better. Better quality. Better video. Better voice audio. So, so, you guys can help me do that. But if you can't afford little things like that, how about a little, how about a little, little comment and, and a thumbs up? Because... That helps a little. That helps a, uh, that helps a little uh, uh, YouTube algorithm. If you haven't subscribed yet, you, you should do that too. But why haven't you yet? But click not, not subscribe. Click that bell too because YouTube sucks, and that bell helps uh, helps you give update the videos. But until that day, until that trial day, never stop learning and enjoy the randomness. I'll see you next time as you go through these uh, these red doors. Bye bye.